everybody, my name is Tony Grillo, and uh, welcome to my channel, Wisconsin Hugs. There's another guy in uh, Wisconsin, He, uh, Tom Grazi, uh, has this great channel that I just love. Um, and uh, he does skits, and he does uh, lives, and he everything he does is all about football. And uh, if you haven't seen his channel, uh, he, he's hilarious. Like, he'll do little skits where every NFL's fan reaction to free agency um, or uh, you know Packers fans versus Jet fans or you know he'll do these little skits like uh, uh, you know a Jets fan reaction to the NFL season and uh, I mean he 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 also does Q and A's, and he he will do lives where he talks to other big bigger channel uh, YouTube people, and uh, uh, he is a a Packers fan, um, but he does a lot of skits here, like a Cowboys fan reaction to the NFL season, and he had one skit where uh, what if the NFL was on Tinder, where he acted like. Every team, uh, each team was uh, somebody that was on Tinder trying to date ladies. It was one of the funniest skits ever. And I thought maybe it'd be funny if I did a skit um, where, what if Tom Grazi, I hope I pronounced his name right, what if he, or maybe it's Grozy. I don't know, Tom Grozy? I say Grozy, but maybe it's Grozy. But anyways, what if Tom Grozy did a NFL skit to Star Trek? And I have no idea how this is going to go. It may be a really bad idea. Uh, but, uh, yeah, I don't know. Go in the comments. You know, Tell me if it sucks or if it's good, if you want to see more of this. Uh, but I'm going to give it a shot. Well, hello there, everybody. Um, it's I'm trying to be uh, I'm trying to imitate Tom Grazi, and I, I don't have a couch right now. I'm doing this out of my semi truck, but uh, I'm trying to do this. I may have to look at. I wrote some things down because I, I can't remember everything, but let's see if I can pull this off. Okay, okay, I'm so pumped for the inaugural uh, first season of the new Enterprise team. Kirk, Spock, and McCoy had three great years and a few really good movies. And now it's 100 years later, and it's time to see uh, the new team in action. And uh, right off the bat, we start out with the opening song, for the next generation and uh, da, 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 da 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 well apparently they took that song from the very first uh, Star Trek movie with Kirk and Spock but it is a good song and it uh, you know almost as good as the original song uh, that our, our 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 team anthem which used to be uh, uh, um, do, 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 do. Wait a minute. I'm, I'm getting that wrong. Um, uh, oh, man, I can't remember how that old song went. But anyways, it's so long ago. Um, it, it's going to come to me later when I keep doing this skip. But let's let's move on here. All right, people, let's move on. So, uh, uh, okay, at QB, we got a veteran uh, Frenchman. Uh, uh, he's a, uh, uh, has a British accent, which is kind of weird for uh, a Frenchman, and he likes to drink, uh, Earl Grey tea. He also doesn't have any hair and looks nothing like our old, uh, QB, but, uh, he is a very eloquent speaker and, uh, Seems to have a commanding presence on the bridge. So we'll see if this veteran can lead our, our team to many, many victories and maybe even a Super Bowl. 
Um, we also have a blind guy at wide receiver. His name is Jordy LaForge, and I'm not sure how that's going to work out. Um, he uh, could be very valuable maybe later on uh, as a uh, uh, a person that that we could use in in uh, engineering uh, where we you know as a coach but we'll see if he can catch the ball or not and uh, we on the positive side we do have an Android at running back and uh, so that could actually be really good for our team um, because Androids should be a lot faster than normal humans they should be a lot stronger um, God, they don't get tired. Uh, so we might actually be able to use him uh, also uh, as a uh, defensive end, which could really tremendously help our defense. Uh, and then uh, we picked up a really great free agent middle linebacker named Worf, and he will definitely uh, be the head of our defense. Um, I could see him being really great uh, at, at that position. Probably be an uh, all-star, um, you know, for many, many, many years. Uh, and we also have a Betazoid on our roster, which she could be very valuable on defense because uh, she might be able to sense whether it's a run or a pass, and that could help our defense tremendously. Um And as far as the season is going, uh, I think our most difficult opponents that we are going to have to face this year will be the Q Continuum. Uh, they are they are a very very powerful team, uh, and they've won the Super Bowl many 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 times. Uh, so it's it's where our quarterback's going to have to have his top game, you know, uh, if if he manages to get a victory against them. Uh, but we also should be able to get an easy win against the Ferengi. Uh, the Ferengi team was supposed to be uh, a, a really, really um, tough team to beat, but uh, I don't know. They, you know, they're pound for pound. They just they're not as big as uh, as our team, uh, so we might have the uh, advantage there. Uh, however, the Romulans, uh, the Romulan team looks really tough. And so we're going to have our hands full battling the Romulans. And the Klingons, well, they don't look too happy that they are placed in the same Federation division as uh, as uh, we are. Uh, you know, the same division as the Federation. They... They appear to um, not like that. The fact that we have to play them twice a season, uh, and and um, they're not too happy about being in our division. Um, but overall, our Federation team, you know, the Enterprise team. I'm sorry, the Enterprise Federation is our division, uh, but the Enterprise team in the Federation division looks fairly good. You know, uh, already in season one. We had Data and Tasha Yar uh, each scoring TDs with each other. Now, I'm not sure if that counts as one TD or two TDs because they scored on each other. So I don't know how that works. But uh, it should be an exciting year uh, for this new Enterprise team. And uh, I, I'm not sure exactly uh, what their uniform colors are going to be. They, 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 they all have different colored jerseys. Uh, like the quarterback wears red, um, but the defense middle linebacker wears yellow. And, uh, uh, you know, the team doctor wears blue. And, uh, uh, you know... Um, so I'm not exactly sure uh, what colors the team is going to, to wear. Uh, maybe we'll find that out later during the season. Uh, but uh, all right, go Enterprise team.
Go, go. All right, I'm out of here, Wisconsin hugs. <laughs> oh yeah, I just remembered uh, the the uh, the old TV series that goes do 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 do